Hello one and all, welcome to Seeing Through Glass. Now today's plan was that I was going to be joining John Modball in his Huracan Spider to try and troll him to buy a car. He's been looking at buying a potential classic car and I thought why not just force him to do so. However, Albert just turned up and said, did I want to borrow his F12 for the day? I think I do. Uh, lift system. Lift there is just right there. That one there, perfect. Like okay, five fine. To get in. No problem at all. Awesome, buddy. That's it. Pretty much. <laughs> this is so outrageous. In. Light to. Oh. Guys, what is happening? <laughs> P. I mean, this is so ridiculous, isn't it? It's Auto. Uh, yeah. First gear, auto. This is just the most outrageous. Literally, today was the day that I was just gonna troll John and be like, buy a car. Then Albert turns up and goes, why didn't you drive my F12? I think I will, Albert. I think I will. <laughs> <laughs> this is too mad. What a nice place to be. Oh, fun <laughs> <laughs> My first ever acceleration to three miles an hour in an F12. Oh, oh, oh. Brakes are good. <laughs> As I slam my head into the bloody roof. <laughs> I'm literally so nervous as well though. Yeah, yeah. It's like amazing and what an opportunity, but I'm kind of shitting myself. Yeah. What a day! <laughs> I love America. I guess the thing about it, I've never really been a huge fan of F12s because I, I prefer mid-engined Ferraris, but... <laughs> That's changing very quickly. <laughs> this thing is mad! I realise this entire video is going to be made up of me making sex-like noises, <laughs> which is all good for everyone, but I don't care. <laughs> John's trying to have some fun now. But yeah, so this this car... It's going to be hard to do this when John's a child in the hurricane and fun. <laughs> Classic Lamborghini driver. Yeah. Having said that, I did just rev two seconds ago. <laughs> but um, yeah, so this car has got a few mods on it. It's got Novatec front lip, Novatec diffuser, and then a DMC rear wing or rear tail lip. So a few mix and match parts, as well as some custom exhaust tips. It's not got an exhaust system on it, just custom exhaust tips. But oh, I'm very nice inside, yellow stitching. Ah, it's just so brilliant! John's going for it, so are we! <laughs> okay, wait, window's up, window's up a little bit. Oh, there's downshifts. So have you got a lot of wind noise there? I was just really concentrating on not crashing. <laughs> I love you! <laughs> Thank you! <laughs> this is the best day ever! It looks so good on the road. Oh, it feels so good! I'm shitting myself. <laughs> you can't just hoon it. You've got four wheel drive. I'm like, ah! We are two absolute twats <laughs> cruising around in our bloody supercars that neither of us own. Can I just make a very clear point? That is not John's car. He's been lent that car. And we're just these absolute English fools cruising around being yobs. I mean, buy into the stereotype much more. I don't think we can. Oh. I can't help but shift gear, it's so unnecessary, I just don't care. Sounds epic. Sounds, Sounds so good, man. Cruising down the inside. Are we going straight over? What a dick. Who does that? 
Who does that? John, John yeah, does. look. Yeah. What a twat. I mean, be more of a supercar knob. Now I can't cut in. Thanks, John. What's he doing? What's he doing? I'm getting taught a lesson by a Chevrolet. <laughs> Guys, that was not my driving, I'm afraid. That was John. Blame him. Such dodgy, dodgy road conditions. Apart from the fact that I know I've got about 700 brake horsepower underneath my right foot, it's actually incredibly easy to drive this car. I was so intimidated when Albert threw me the keys. But, apart from, as I say, just this immense power and the knowledge that you have this immense power, it's totally fine. The steering is just so beautiful. Even around town, you can pick up on how light and direct it is. Oh, and then that soundtrack. <laughs> but honestly, I'm using about 15% of the throttle. like we have arrived what an insane experience that i just cruised here in an f12 and now i've got to navigate some freaking mental not good reverse no, it's really. oh shit man yeah. i'm sorry okay no, back no i knew it when i saw it this is the problem with ferrari ownership <laughs> in la specifically we good good you're good good awesome Whoa. <laughs> oh god, he's already bought a car. Is this it? No. I'm gonna be honest, it's a little bit of a disappointment. Check out these doors. Suits you there. Look at the doors on this. Oh, suicide doors. Baller! Do you reckon they'll stay on though? No, this will definitely break down. Okay, so here we are. Um, and this is. John, what's this place called? Beverly Hills Car Club. Beverly Hills Car Club, which is where this man right here is gonna be buying a car. He has no, 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 no choice no. in the matter. And I honestly think, after my experience just now, you need to buy a Ferrari. If I buy a car today, you're doing a skydive on the model. Not a fucking chance. That's what's happening. Oh, mate, it suits you. You look like a total bell end, it's perfect. Mm -hmm. This is this is like gonna be like a mod ball girl now. This is what all the mod ball girls do, get in your passenger seat. No, no one does that. Should I start it? Am I allowed to start it? I oh, doubt you're allowed to yeah. start it. Yeah, it'd be fun. You just started your new car for the first time. <laughs> They're gonna be pissed off at that. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> We're getting kicked out of here straight away. Damn. Back so John is about to go on a test drive in his next car. I am forcing him to buy this car. Um, what we haven't talked about is the reason he's actually down here and considering this for the Mobile Rally next year is it is all for charity. His plan is to buy a car, try and complete the Mobile European Rally in 2017 with the car and then auction it off and the profits will go to, I think he did the Make-A-Wish charity. As I say, he's gonna go for a test drive. Amazingly, he's taking a mechanic with him because it's a classic car. I'm gonna try and jump back in the F12. I'll let Albert drive so I can film from the passenger seat and see what this 308 looks like on the road. test drive. <laughs> 
Talk to me. It actually dries really well. It looks good. Everything works. It's almost too good to be true. <laughs> Back in the F12. My brilliant day continues. So I have no idea if John's gonna buy that Ferrari. I think he should because Ferrari is the best things in the world. I am now getting some GoPro set up. Unbelievably, we are now going to look at a C63 coupe uh, for Mr. Albert, who owns this lovely F12. Um, so it's like a day of mad people uh, potentially buying cars. I feel like I should go and look at um, some toy cars in the, in the toy shop, because uh, I can't afford to buy anything for real. Um, but yeah, it means I get to jump back into this mad F12. It's ridiculous, this is one of the best days I've ever had in my entire life. at Mercedes Beverly Hills. Um, that was quite a boring traffic drive, but still absolutely immense to spend it in the F12. I'm becoming slowly obsessed. Um, and we are here to buy Albert a C63 coupe. He uh, thinks he's just coming to check it out, but it's a day where we force people to buy cars. <laughs> we don't actually, by the way, I sound like a total dick. Like, yeah, let's all spend money. <laughs> um, it's only a joke. People. You force people. Well, you haven't actually bought a car yet, John. So. <laughs> So Albert's just come here to check out the C63S Coupe. Uh, he's looking at a privately customer owned car. They don't actually have any available for him to test drive or check out, but he's thinking of adding one to the fleet. In America, I really think these cars look awesome. I haven't seen many on the street in the UK, um, but I've seen a few cruising around in LA and they do look awesome. And then yeah, John's got distracted as only John could by a bright yellow AMG GTS. Um, it has been an insane day of car shopping with supercars. Um, I'm now very thirsty and very hungry, so. Insane colour on this hurricane, totally putting John to shame in his stealth spec. Such a badass noise. And then uh, that white van ish kind of thing. Man, thank you so much oh, for today. Sure. It's been freaking yeah, awesome. Definitely, definitely. It's been a hell of a lot of fun. And I'm back home. What an absolutely mad but awesome day. I can't believe that I ended up spending the day driving an F12 around. I hope you guys have enjoyed this quite random video. Give it a thumbs up if you have and make sure to subscribe for plenty more videos to come.